hey guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new hey welcome to the belafonte family i just wanted to show you guys quickly how i do my sleek height puff ball on my short natural hair so we're just going to jump into it and you see here that i'm just coming up my naps because it's been a long week and um finding random pins and stuff in my hair stuff i forgot to take out last time but yeah guys just make sure you comb it all out make sure you get all the kinks out before you uh do your sleek puff um to make it a little bit easier for me i go ahead with um, my trusty spray bottle and i get all my edges my front and my back um it just has conditioner water and oil then i get my brush and um my toothbrush my scarf i'm just showing you guys everything that i have so i'm just gonna put my scarf around me because water's dripping and i'm getting ready for work and i don't want none of that on my clothes so i'm gonna take my gel i think that's the extra version olive oil one and i'm just gonna put that all around my edges so i can get the sleek puff popping you know what i'm saying so i'm gonna get it to the front but i just come down far so i feel like i'm putting it on my eyebrows but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and brush it all into my edges making my front my back and my sides too just to make sure everything looks sleek and put together now y'all i know this is ratchet but i use a shoelace okay this came out my hoodie and i'm like you know what anyway i got time to run down to sally's or the beauty supply store so i'm, I'm gonna use this you know this string right here so just make sure they're even and um hmm, how do i explain this you tie it like how you fit a tie a shoe and you just pull it and the more you pull the more it'll go up on your hair so as you see me doing here i'm just pulling putting a little bit of pressure a a a dope look at that and that's my sleek that's my sleek little puff so I'll go ahead and i tie it in the back and i secure it with a pen just to make sure um i hide the end of the lace so now i'm just checking to make sure everything's good then i take my little dirty old you know toothbrush that my mom saw she probably would yell at me and i'm just going to go ahead and smooth my edges down like how i usually do if you guys are interested in seeing a video on how i do it then i can post that but this is just a sped talk through video for now so then after that i'm going to go ahead and um tie my hair and i'll do it backwards don't ask me why i just favor doing it this way it lays my edges down flatter for some reason so i'm just going to tuck that in and make sure all my hair is covered properly and since i'm going to work i'll show you guys as well how i do like my minimalistic um routine for like makeup and things like that so i just use some moisturizer for neutrogena neutrogena to make sure that my face is smooth and moisturized for the rest of the day and um i'm also going to do my brows and stuff and i do that off camera so now i just have my tart palette and this is not even i'm not even using it for eyeshadow i'm using oh yeah girl i'm using it for that like light highlight i'm not trying to blind nobody at work I'm just trying to be basic so then it's been some quite a time since i've done all that so i'm gonna take it off my scarf yes take that off Ooh, and the measure is laid as late as they gonna get because i can't be late for work y'all works out at eight o'clock so yeah i'm just checking making sure that everything's uh looking good brushing down my edges with my fingers yes admire yourself girl then i'm um, just showing you guys what it looks like a little slight highlight i got going on and then i'm going to take some blush and put it on my cheek so i don't look dead oh yes and i have high cheekbones so i like to do this and it just i don't know it looks makes me look a little sniggity snatched so yeah i like to do that so now I'm like, okay, that Fenty, 
that Fenty though, that Fenty uncensored though, sis, sis, I'm ready for it. I picked it up from Sephora. It's my first time using it, but I'm going to use a lip liner because I see how crazy it looks. And you'll see my expression in a hot second. But first, I'm just going to line my lips. And I just wanted to show you guys this because I don't see a lot of stuff on YouTube about, like, lining lips. I'm just using the um, brow pencil that I use since it's like a dark brown. But yeah, it looks pretty nice. I just overdraw my lips a little bit. But like, here's the moment, y'all. Here's the moment when I'm going to use this lip paint. I thought y'all was lying when you said that it was pigmented. I really thought y'all was lying on me. Look at my face. Okay. I'm, I'm going to be silent for this. Ooh. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Look at that. That's crazy. Come on. Come on. Like, come on. That's crazy. Y'all yeah, see how red and all oh, is beautiful. And how pigmented that is. Mm-mm. Yeah, I'm over it. I am I I I'm just feeling myself to to the highest degree. Honestly. Look at that. Yo, that is so bright to me, and it looks so good on my skin tone. I don't know if it's like a blue red or an orange red. Yeah, I don't know, but it looks really, really nice. And, it, and this is just me dipping the brush in once. I didn't have to dip this back in into applicator. Um, this is just one, one time. Y'all yeah, flossing with just one. Like this is this is great. Okay, guys, but I'm I'm done admiring myself. You know, I'm, I'm I have to get to work. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this Fenty slash. You know, this like sleek bun. You know, I got going on. Um, and yeah, this is just this is just how I finna be fly. You know, getting ready for work. But yeah, that's the end of it, guys. I'll catch you later. Bye. Thank you.